So now what are we going to do? I don't know. Find answers, I guess. Answers to what exactly? What killed my family? And the people back at the orphanage? Don't you mean who? What I saw wasn't normal, Sky. No matter how sick of a person you are, no human could do those things. What things? You don't want to know. I probably don't, but I need to. There was so much blood and... And what else? Body parts and insides. <gasps> oh. You're right. I didn't want to know. The thing is, it, it looked familiar. Do you remember anything from... the night your parents were killed? Bits and pieces, but not enough to know what happened. What do you remember, Evelyn? Screaming. And then this beautiful bright light. Those don't exactly fit together. I could remember something wrong. I mean, I was like three years old. Uh, that's weird. Should we open it? I will. You stay back here. Oh, so overprotective. Hi, are you Evelyn Hansen? Man, I hope so. Why are you looking for her? Well, we have a friend that told us she is staying in this room and that we need to speak to her. We have to give her some answers. Oh, I'm Evelyn Hansen. Can we come in? I guess so. Uh, who are you? I'm Oliver, and this is Chester. Okay, give us some answers. Can't give an answer without a question. Okay. What killed my family and the orphanage? Probably demons. Chester, you have to be slower when explaining these things. Demons? Evelyn, these guys are crazy. Don't be so sure, Skye. Were they killed in gruesome and violent ways? Yes. There was... well... It's okay. You don't have to go into detail. Definitely demons. I'm sorry, but... 
Demons don't exist. They do exist. They possess other bodies and do horrible things. From what I've seen, I believe you. Oh, and are there vampires too? Werewolves? Vampires aren't as clean as the movies make them. And the werewolf... It's just a type of shapeshifter. Are you hearing this? Yes, Sky. Can you prove it? Well, I can show you one type of supernatural. A traveler. Okay, what is that? It can travel through time. You recognize them by the three moles that form a triangle on their face. Like mine. So that means you're a traveler? Yes, and I can take you to a time dimension whenever I want. Okay. Take us to the day me and Sky met. Okay. Just don't leave my sight or you're in trouble. Whoa! What the hell? How did we get here? I brought you to the day you two met. Let's go inside. Evelyn, come down here. This is Sky. She's a new addition, and I'd like for you to show her around. Okay, come with me. All that's down here is the kitchen, really. Nobody can see us. It's alright. Have a nice day. Now, let's go upstairs. This is where the girls sleep. You can sleep next to me if you want. Is there anywhere to play? Yes! Sometimes, when everyone else is busy or sleeping, I go out through the window. But what if you fall? Well, I usually just sit there, looking at the sky or people on the street. Can I go out there? Yeah, but let's keep it a secret between you and me, okay? Okay, I promise. We can go back now.
So, are you believers now? Yeah, I just, I'm processing. You said that a friend told you where we were. Who was that? Dimitri. He's not so much a friend, really. Evelyn. You're a lot more important than you think. How am I important? We don't know. The angels don't tell us everything. Wait, what? Angels? We should probably teach you about all the creatures out there. Yeah, teach us tomorrow. We need time to accept this. We're staying in the same hotel. Room 312, in case you'd like to know. Ugh, we don't want to know. Now, bye. You two be careful. Don't let anyone in. Yeah. Okay. Because there are demons and vampires and whatever else is out there. That's the spirit. So, demons, huh? What are you thinking so hard about? My sister. They've probably done worse to her than killing her. Or maybe something else took her. Maybe the light you saw took her somewhere. Doubtful. Cool.